Hi guys, I'm Astix Audio Media Production here to present you this amazing audio interface. This is the Antilope Audio Discrete 8 Pro Synergy Core. Before jump into the review, I just want to say thanks to Milk Audio Store. They sent me this unit to check out and try out here for you. If you are interested to purchase this unit, you have the link in the description. Uh, Milk Audio can send, can ship all around the globe. So without any problem. Antelope Audio is a really great company that built super high quality audio interface for studios. Uh, this is the Discrete 8 Pro, is the new version of the Discrete 8. Let's talk about uh, the unit, all its features, and then I'll show you how this unit sounds with also some plugins because you have built-in plugins. Really high quality plugins, guys. So with this unit, you can get 26 input and 32 output. It's enough. I think you can also expand of course if it's not enough for you let's start with the frontal panel as you can see you have two combo input uh, for your preamps these two preamps can be switched to uh, mic line or high impedance only these two can be set to high impedance all the others only microphone and line you have then eight different potentiometer for your preamps these are clicked 1 db step then you have this lcd this is really convenient to have because you can monitor all your uh, meter and also to manage the menu so aside you have three different switches really tiny to go inside the browse menu and maybe to dim or mute the output various output this is all to manage your menu then you have this giant uh, also this is stepped in 1 db this is to control your main volumes uh, volume 1 and volume 2 i'll talk about the volume 2 in a moment and then of course you have the dedicated output for your headphones and the dedicated um, potentiometer for your preamps of the headphones really great headphones preamps here so you can manage really high impedance headphones that requires also high current talking about the rear panel you can see a lot of things first of all you can see the rest of the six preamps these are mic and line preamps then you have a dedicated output for the reamp and this is your volume 2 because you can also manage this reamp output not only as a reamp but you can also switch internally with the dedicated uh, software manager to be a monitor so you can use this as secondary monitor and basically if you can see you have also the first monitor output uh, you can get basically two pair of monitors to make your mixing and decision this is really convenient so talking about the reamp basically inside there is a reamp box because you can send the signal from this directly to your amplifier and reamp with your real gear this is super convenient because i can do this um, managing without having other reamp box other cables other maybe it's not a passive reamp box it's an active reamp box so i need also the plug it's really convenient to have high quality reamp box inside this unit then you have the output eight output via the d sub this is the plug for your output line output you can also expand all this output with the adat as you can see you have four different port of adat and you have also spdif of course you have four different plugs for the master clock and the versatility of this unit is that you can use this both on windows or mac because you have the both the output on usb 2.0 or Thunderbolt 3. This is really versatile. The last plug you have is the foot switch, as you can see here. This is uh, for or a single foot switch or a double foot switch. Basically, you can manage the talkback on and off and also the attenuation of the volume, so the dim on and off. Talking about the talkback, I forgot to mention here you have the button for the talkback. Basically, you have here a built-in microphone. You can use this 
pressing and talk to your audio interface basically you are sending the uh, the talkback to maybe a headphone to your artist in other uh, room so this is really also convenient you can also use this button uh, not to engage the inside microphone so the talkback that it's inside but you can also engage another microphone used as talkback so maybe your microphone in your desk as I have one my low tone audio uh, so all this management can be done inside the plugin because the plugin that you receive with this audio interface is really amazing really well made you can manage all your mixers up to four different mixers you can manage all your output uh, what you want to listen in an headphones or another headphones on in a monitor main monitor or maybe the reamp becomes your second monitor so you can do everything in the, inside the software and it is really simple to use another one thing that i want to mention is that with this unit you receive 37 fx built in basically there is a dsp inside that can elaborate all the processing of the plugins plugins are really high quality let me mention something you have the uh, ala2a compressor you have the 1176 compressor you have the pull tech emulation old style of pool tech so you have a lot of things preamps um, compressor equalizer vintage equalizer uh, some chorus you have the reverb called auraverb which is uh, proprietary the antilope audio which is a, an amazing reverb guys you can manage everything you have basically a, a giant view of all the channels you can send all the channels you want to this reverb amazing i don't want to go too in deep on this uh, plugin because you can basically manage everything about this uh, audio interface so this video will be too too much long <laughs> i mean um, so let's listen how this unit sounds so let's listen the preamp also in a raw signal with different microphone i have the singer is jacopo sicardi of course so i've used two different microphones the first microphone is a condenser microphone that does not require too much preamp and uh, you will listen both raw and with built-in plugins processing then we will listen also another microphone the microphone that i'm using right now the lowton audio ls208 really similar to the sm7b so it requires a lot of power and i use maybe plus 41 db of preamps but we will listen will be really clear so the preamps the discrete eight preamps that you can get with this unit are fabulous really noiseless and really clear and we will listen then also with some plugins also built-in plugins also preamps to manage maybe some color that you want to add to these really clean preamps then i also uh, play something with the bass we will listen to the high of the bass and also for guitar the high for the guitar and also amped because you have also the plugins for the the bass so amplifier cabinets for bass for guitars so you basically let me say you don't need to purchase other plugins if you want to um produce you need only to purchase this unit really high quality unit yes it's not cheap in italy is two thousand euros but you have a complete bundle of everything you have a super high quality preamps really noiseless you have super expandability i don't know if it's okay in english expandability and you have 37 fx built in so this fx will not be processed by your cpu of your computer but is the audio interface that will process all these plugins and if it's not enough for you you can also purchase different effects other effects from antilope audio and will be again processed by the audio interface so let's listen how this unit sounds racconta la luna una storia d'amore 
stringimi le mani, fammi sentire il cuore. Non tremare questa notte, amica mia, non aver paura mai. Domani avremo tempo per tornare a lottare, ma ora, prima che risorga il sole, rimani insieme a me. Racconta la luna una storia d'amore E stringi le mie mani, fammi sentire il cuore oh, 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 oh. Non tremare questa notte amica mia Non aver paura ma ne avremo tempo per tornare a lottare, ma ora, prima che risorga il sole, rimani insieme a me. As you heard, the quality is stunning, really amazing. You have basically every effects, you really need to create something in high quality, okay? So I'm really impressed about the quality of this unit and I'm really thinking about to purchase one. I'm using this unit for one month, basically. What is the reason why I'm thinking about to purchase one of these units? First of all is the reamp. I really love to have a dedicated reamp um, plug to go directly to my amplifier. I really like to use real gear. It's different to use effects. Yes, you have super high quality effects, but it's more versatile to use real gear. And not to have to purchase another uh, reamp box or other cables and stuff like that is really convenient. The second reason is the versatility to use both USB and Thunderbolt because sometimes I also use my uh, laptop, Windows laptop. So maybe, I don't know, but maybe I will have the possibility to use with my Windows. Maybe not because I love Mac, <laughs> but is really, really convenient. And another thing, 
is the built-in processor, the built-in DSP that you can use to, to manage all the plugins. You can really uh, use this audio interface with all the plugins power on in uh, all the channels, basically. It's really, really powerful. I have to mention one thing. There is a downsize. You can use these FX also in your DAW. So basically you can have a, a plugin called AFX to DO, and with this plugin, you will engage all the plugins that you have inside this DSP. So you can use the, the plugin, the effects that you have inside, both to tracking, basically to send some reverb and some compressor directly to the uh, headphone of your artist, and you will not record this. If you want, you can also record this. You can manage everything inside the plugin manager. But if you want, you can also use the same plugin, different instance in your DAW, whatever kind of DAW, because you have this AFX to DAW plugin. This plugin, however, will work only if you connect the Antilope Discrete 8 Pro with the Thunderbolt. So only via Thunderbolt, you can use the AFX to DAW. So to use the built-in effects with your DAW, always elaborate with the, um, this audio interface, okay? So the plugins can be used both with Thunderbolt and USB tracking, but if you want to use in your DAW, you need a Thunderbolt cable, okay? This is a downside, so you have to keep in mind this. Okay, guys, you have the link in the description if you are interested. Again, thanks to uh, Milk Audio Store. You can purchase directly from Milk Audio Store. They are really an amazing company, really large company here in Italy, distributor of really high-end product. So they can ship all around the globe. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you think about this unit if you are thinking about to purchase one I'm, I'm really thinking about too. Yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Bye.